That's exactly right. Mod Pizza has long been known to hire people involved in the justice system and says now that help needs to go beyond employment. Hi guys, welcome in. And have you been here before? Yeah. Awesome. Welcome back. What's your name? Well, you wouldn't know it. Are we doing a pizza for you? Yeah. This job is a second chance. And you want it for here to go, Moses? For here? For Chelsea Johnson. My life is so different from before I got incarcerated. You can take it right ready? here. Johnson had just served a four year prison sentence when she decided to apply for a job. For somebody like the, me that's a drug addict, right? In and out of jail, in and out of prison, nothing was working. Johnson was offered a job at Mod Pizza and worked her way up. Eventually, over the course of like two years, I worked my way all the way up to being a general manager. One in three Americans have a criminal record, according to the nonprofit The Sentencing Project. The unemployment rate for somebody who's been justice involved is five times higher than somebody who's not been justice involved. Alice Venson is the co-owner of Mod Pizza and says she had hired underserved populations from the beginning, but she was looking for help with wraparound services like housing and transportation. There are a lot of incredible nonprofits and regional local organizations all around the country but to create a national network where you can do it at scale it doesn't exist. So Svensson is creating her own with the Mod Opportunity Network with partners like Goodwill, Fair Star, and Best Buddies. There is talent everywhere, uh, but unfortunately, opportunity is not everywhere for a lot of these individuals. Do you want anything over here on there? Talented employees like Johnson. I'm a homeowner, which is absolutely insane. And I'm about to have my first child, right? Like my life is steadily just continuously getting better and better and I'm progressing seeing more and more in my life. Now, Johnson tells me she hopes her story will encourage more companies to give people a second chance. And the network will launch in 11 states, including here in Washington. Live here in West Seattle, I'm Kristen Goodwillie, King 5 News.